Yeah, wanna know what it's like Life. Baby, show me what it's like Life. I don't want to fight no tights Life. I just wanna fuck all night Yeah, yeah Oh, 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 oh. Mm. Baby, mm. I need to know mm. Oh. Mm. I just been fantasizing mm. And we got a lot of time mm. Baby, come throw the pipe mm. Gotta know what it's like Yeah, yeah Oh, 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 oh. What up, though, Scorpio? What's cracking, lagging? I hope that all of my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios out there are doing well. So we're going to get into this reading and see what it is that Spirit wants you to know. But before we do that, let me make a quick announcement. I am running a special on my readings right now, okay? Your love reading going to be 25. Career, money, and finance going to be 30. Twin flame going to be 35. If you don't want a reading, you just got a question for you, girl. We got one question for 15, two for 25, and three for 35, Okay. So let's get into it, you guys, and see what you need to know. Messages for my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios. I want to say hello to anybody that's new or anyone that is returning to my channel. All right, messages for Scorpio. What do they need to know? Let's get one more. All right. So these are messages from your higher self, okay? So this could be someone... Who's trying to communicate with you on a 5D or this could be what you're thinking subconsciously okay does this person or situation allow me to be my true authentic self so i feel like either you or someone in your energy is in a situation right they can be in a marriage they can be in a relationship but they don't feel like they really get to be them so this is someone who feels like they got to wear a mask around someone like they really can't be their true authentic self. Or, you know, maybe around certain people or a certain person, they just feel like they can't be themselves. So someone here is questioning, is this person or this situation that I'm in, this could be work related. You know, am I being able to be my true authentic self? Does my family want the best for me? Okay, so some of you could be wondering or someone around you could be questioning. It's like, you know, you want to hope and you want to believe that your family wants the best for you, but then it's like the reaction that you get or, you know, some of the negative energy that you feel from them or some of the negative things that they've been saying, like, that shit don't add up. So I feel like some of you are questioning, like, does your family really want the best for you or do they just want you to do what the hell they want you to do, okay? Have I planted the seeds for the things that I truly desire in the future? So I feel like some of you are, you've been manifesting, right? And you've been trying to plant these seeds because you're trying to create some type of life. You're trying to create some type of uh, financial stability. Like you're trying to create something for yourself, your family, whomever. But you're not sure. I feel like because it's taking a little longer than what you expected, you're not sure if you plant the right seeds for the things that you want in the future here. And then we also have, is it time to say goodbye? So somebody could be questioning, Scorpio, is it time to walk away? from someone okay this could be how you're feeling maybe you're in a little situation a relationship a marriage it doesn't matter you know but you feel like at this present time you know or someone could be questioning like you know this just isn't working like whatever used to work or whatever they was doing at work in the past like that shit ain't working no more and they could be questioning like is it time to tell this person in this situation goodbye because someone here is realizing or could be realizing like they haven't been able to be their true authentic self being around this person they always feel like they gotta wear a mask or you know this person want to accept them for who they are and i feel like someone here is it could be thinking about saying goodbye here so let's pull Scorpio and let's see what this reading or who this reading is about. Messages for my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios. What do they need to know? Messages for Scorpio, Holy Spirit. What is it that my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios, what do they need to know? Ooh. Messages for Scorpio. I have addictions and I am no good for you, okay? So somebody could be suffering from addiction, Scorpio, okay? This could be sex addiction. This could be drug addiction. This could be uh, somebody who's addicted to money. You know, this could be drugs, alcohol, some type of addiction, addiction here. And I feel like with this addiction, like this is someone who has allowed the enemy, the devil, to kind of take over their life. That this could be someone who's trying to cope. But it's like the more that they use these drugs or alcohol or liquor, whatever it is they're using to cope, like it's just really 
I feel like it's really getting out of control here, okay? So someone here feels like until they can control these addictions, like there's nothing that they can do for you here, okay? All right, messages for my Scorpio. Tell us more. What does Scorpio need to know? I don't know if I could ever be who you need me to be, okay? So someone here, now this could be the same person that's struggling with this addiction or someone here just doesn't feel like Scorpio. They're, they're not going to ever be able to be this man or this woman that you need them to be, not you want them to be. You need them to be. It's the difference between wanting someone to be your way and you need this person. This person needs to be a certain way to match your flow, to match your energy, okay? And they don't know if they can be that person. Messages for Scorpio. Tell us more. What is it that my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios? What do they need to know? I love you, Scorpio. Would you hear me out if I try to explain myself? Okay, so I feel like you have the energy of someone who you know, wants to explain the past. They want to talk about everything has happened, especially if you currently separated from someone. But I feel like what keeps this person from coming towards you or, you know, what makes them real unsure is they're not sure if you're going to hear them out. So this could have been someone who I feel like they lie. You know, I'm getting the energy of somebody who cried wolf. Like they done did this shit before. They done told you the same old sob story. You know, this is someone who done told you they're going to do some shit before. And I feel like they didn't. So it's like this go around. It's like you tired of hearing the same old shit. You know, it's like, damn, you done told me this before. Like you said you weren't going to hurt me no more. You was going to do this and do that. But you ain't made no changes here. So someone here, I feel like maybe want to try to explain the situation one more time. And this is the energy of someone who has never explained themselves to you, okay? But they're just unsure if you will be willing to hear them out. So this could be definitely someone who knows that you're not trying to talk to them. You could have told this person you don't want to talk to them, Scorpio. I know I did you wrong and you did not deserve this, okay? So someone here could have did something to you or how they handled this, this situation was when they were under the influence, okay, of these addictions. Like I said, and I don't know exactly what all addictions this person could be suffering from, but they had numerous addictions, right? So I feel like this person being in this energy, this low vibrational ass energy, like this is when this person hurts you. So like when they were, I feel like in this energy, this devil energy, that's what I'm picking up. When this person was being the devil, Scorpio, you know, they, they realize now like, man, I, Scorpio didn't deserve this. She like, why the hell did I even treat Scorpio like that? So someone here knows they did you wrong. Like there's no doubt in their mind that they did you wrong. And they realize Scorpio, you didn't deserve this shit. Tell us more, Holy Spirit. I know I have to make a decision. It's in my face, okay? So someone here, like, I feel like spirit is putting all what everybody needs to see or what this person needs to see, like, right there in their face, okay? There is no running. There is no denying here. So someone here knows that they have to make a decision. This is their energy is, is it time to say goodbye? Because it's like intuitively they know. They're not done, Scorpio. They know they have to make a decision. And someone here is realizing that it may be time to say goodbye scorpio you can be feeling like it's time to say goodbye you can be the one that's having to make a decision y'all take this how it resonates here okay let's get one more and then we're gonna pull we're gonna pull some tarot messages for scorpio let's get one more i might just end this here because I'm trying to get some more videos out for you guys today, okay? My feelings don't make sense to me. So, so I feel like someone here has been trying the best to make sense of these feelings and emotions that they have for you, okay? So someone here could be overwhelmed by, like, how they feel. But it's like they don't understand. Like, someone here really doesn't understand, like, their feelings for you. You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't... I feel like someone could be confused, but I feel like it's more of the energy of someone who was in denial. It's like now that... It's being shown to this person, like, yes, you do love Scorpio. Like, yes, those feelings and those emotions that you had, all those, everything that you was thinking in the past, that was love. And I feel like this is the energy of someone who tries to deny the fact that they didn't love you, okay? Um, let's pull it from the who did Scorpio. I know these are a little shorter today, but like I said, I'm trying to get out more readings just for today, so... I got y'all tomorrow. I'll just be all Scorpio tomorrow, but I'm trying to get through some of the Zodiac as well today, Scorpio, without having to sit and record for a long, long time, okay? 
All right, Holy Spirit. So who is this reading about for my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios? Let's get one more. Messages for my Scorpios, Holy Spirit. Who is this reading about? Let's get five cards. One, two, three. One, two, three. <laughs> Let me shuffle this again. Who is this reading about? Okay, so Scorpio, you can have big lips. Or this can be your person. Young female, you can be younger than this person. They can be younger than you. Someone who has braids or dreads. Messages for my Scorpios. What do they need to know? Hmm. All right, someone who has straight hair. <laughs> and big booty Judy here. All right, you guys. And then we're going to take this one, average high female. So let's get the signs. Let's see who this reading is about for Scorpio. All right, Aquarius, Leo, Virgo, Cancer. Capricorn, Libra, Sag, Aquarius. Libra, Cancer, Gemini, and Sag. All right, you guys, I love you. And until next time, stay blessed.